All right, guys, I am here with Chiodos, uh, you know, at least a part. And so um, if you guys, yeah, uh, if you guys could just um, introduce yourself with your name and what you play in the band. I am Matt Goddard, and I play bass guitar. I am Bradley Bell, and I play the keyboards. Awesome. So uh, could we just start off with how the crowd reactions are going for Warped? Like, what have you guys expected, and how's it, uh, you know, met up to your expectations? It's been going great so far. We're still early in the tour, so... Uh, so far, so good. It's been great. Yeah, it's been cool because like we've taken some time off over the last couple of years, and just to uh, come back and see that people still give a shit is really cool. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, like, let's talk about that a little bit. Um, do you guys ever think you'd be back here at Warped, like after you know somewhat of a hiatus uh, with member changes and whatnot? Honestly, no. Nope. If Peter asked me last year if this was going to happen, I would probably laugh, laugh it off. But I'm glad to be here. This is awesome. It's great that we have uh, the the bands back together again. Yeah. At first, we were just trying to take like a small step at a time, doing like reunion like weekends and stuff. And then uh, the opportunity came up for this, and uh, everyone was feeling it, so we decided to do it. How have fans reacted to the member changes? They've embraced Thomas very well, their new guitar player. Yeah, there hasn't really been any backlash with uh, Thomas joining the band, so I, I think. Uh, Everyone's really excited to see what he's going to bring and what element he can add to our music. So with such a wide variety of songs that you guys have been like coming out with in you know, various years, um, what does your set list look like for this Warp Tour? Like how much is coming from you know, Illuminatio and then how much is coming from past albums, you know, the, the first Chiodos that everyone heard? We got a good mix. We're not playing anything off of Illuminatio. I think that's just kind of weird. Uh, oh, that's not good. Uh -oh. One storm. But we have like a good mix of old stuff. We have, we're playing a new song this tour and some stuff about Bone Palace and and also Thermacare, which was post Bone Palace. Yep. So try to cover all all ranges. All right. So, um, what bands have you guys kind of observed uh, throughout this Warp Tour that you just kind of like enjoy watching? You know, I mean, you're playing a lot, but what would you like to? What band would you like to see? I haven't really had a lot of opportunity to check out a lot of bands yet, just because like the first couple days in, you're trying to get used to your schedule and hang out with friends and stuff. And uh, I've checked out that live, that was uh, really entertaining. But anything else that I've really watched has been at the acoustic tent. I'm more of a like a chill type of music listener, anyways. So Matt Embry, Nate Sanders, that's that's all been good. Same Z's. <laughs> All right, so just lastly, um, if you guys had some advice for upcoming bands um, to get to you know, the form of success that you guys have gotten to, what would it be? Uh, move back in with your parents, quit your job, <laughs> and say goodbye to all your friends. And don't stick dick and crazy. Especially that. <laughs> all right, guys, well, uh, that is Chiodos. Uh, thanks for having us, and uh, that's Kaim Interviews, guys. Take it easy. We're so close.